Hello. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Rogan. And I'm Harrison. And obviously this is our channel. Um, so we've got a video coming up after this clip and disclaimer, it is from December slash January from when we moved house. So plenty of Christmas decorations. Yeah, a bit of Christmas talk in there. We just got back from New York. It was snowing outside. Fingers was. crossed it was snow. <laughs> now we're in May. Um, but yeah, basically, we've had this vlog ready to go up for like... Months. Literally, once we were in the house settled, like, it was all edited mm -hmm. and ready to go, like in January. But for other reasons... We could not. We were not able to post this vlog until now because everything is finally done. It's all... So, so you're welcome. <sighs> Thankfully. It's here. And like it's we little... always say, we we try and be as real and realistic yeah, and yeah. lifestyle as possible. So it was only right that now we've got the chance to post it. Yeah, that we do post it because we've like we put the effort into it, and, and it's, it's like it's like a part of it's yeah, a part yeah. of our lives. Like it's part of our little journey story because thing. Without this video, we've gone from just being in that house to all of a sudden yeah. recording everything in this house without kind of the crossover and like even just to watch back. But yeah, no, we want to post it, but we also want to just like. Give you the update and give like a little disclaimer that like this is jumping back in time like oh yeah that's true a few yeah. months <laughs> like we're going back to 2022 here at the start of this video we've not just put the the decorations up in the middle of may maybe we should <laughs> maybe that's a sign um but yeah i say a lot of it as well there's a story from the time like another day mm -hmm. sorry people moving in the street there's a taxi driver just, just being nosy off. having a look out like <laughs> i was watching oh, God, get drenched it's on the doorstep no no she's going in now Oh, that's right. But yeah, the story behind the whole move thing, we are able to like tell that story now. Like, yeah, we, we can do that. But this isn't that's like, I mean, that's it's too a, long. That's another video. That's another video. Yeah. If you want to see that kind of thing, then let us know. We can spill the tea, but we'll do that in another video because yeah. that'll be a long video, I imagine. This like, is just bridging the gap as to why you've yeah. seen us in one house and then for the last few videos we've been No, we're just here. scooting back in time. Yeah. But yeah, we'll um, leave you. If you do enjoy it, give it a mini like and see you in the next one. See you in the next video. Well, you well, you, you'll yeah. see us in this yeah, video, yeah. but then we'll see you in the next video because this is present day. You know yeah. what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Anyway, um, we hope you enjoy it and go watch the video. Go on. Scoot on over there, right? Bye. Bye for now. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. If you're new around here, my name is Brogan and I make all kinds of lifestyle content, but let's get on to the video. So the last time you would have seen me, it would have been me and Harrison traveling back from New York when our flight was canceled, we had to run through the airport. Oh, it was very stressful, but we made it, we made it anyway. So we had a very quick turnaround. We stayed in Bedford one day, we were shattered, we like slept all day basically, woke up, snowing outside you know it's been absolutely minus degrees snow ice everywhere anyway drove back up to newcastle and yeah the day after we collected the keys to our new house which we're moving into but we didn't find this out until we were on the a1 well we we're planning on getting the keys this day but it wasn't confirmed until we were on the a1 driving up so i was driving harrison's ringing like and um, virgin and stuff saying can you put the wi-fi i got it's been like it's been a mad week it's been a very mad week so we land on the monday it's now saturday got the keys on the wednesday and since then we've just been moving and stuff and uh, it's gonna take you long for the little journey but i could have started this earlier but i haven't because it's just been crazy it's been a bit of a crazy week but you know all positive things the one issue at the new house at the minute is because of the mad mad weather there is the boilers not working so it's freezing so when we're moving stuff over there it's absolutely freezing we've got like no hot water like we don't even have the water on at the minute like so we're going from this house which is a story time for another day to a house which is freezing but the house which is freezing is a lot better than what the situation that we're in right now so <laughs> positives negatives it's all right the boiler's an easy fix no stress no stress anyway the washer's just beeped so i'm gonna go put that on a spin then i'll catch up with you again also I don't know how much space is on the memory card or how like how charged the battery is because I filmed a lot in New York and I haven't had the time to take it off yet. So if it goes to the phone, that is why. Anyway, wash is on a spin. Yeah, so I've just been packing up some more stuff this morning. We're gonna take it over again. Harrison, Harrison finishes at 11, I think. So he'll be back soon, then we'll take some more stuff over. It's just been crazy. I need to take this once this washer's spun 
can't draw things here because again a story from the time i need to take them over to my grandma's house who lives just over the road that way put them on her radius thank you grandma she'll probably watch this who knows hi and then we'll go back over to the house and yeah it's just crazy but i'll take you along i'll give you a little walk through of what's going on in the current house where i am right now obviously we're in the living room i've cleared this unit this is all brand work which i need to get done but with like um, Royal Maid deliveries and stuff, everything was delayed, so then it didn't come till whilst I was away, so it's been a bit of a chaos, but you know, it's all exciting stuff. Check me in scrap and see these. A mess here, but that's about to be packed. This is still backpacking stuff from New York, there's the camera case. Chaos, chaos, all the advent calendars, Hershey's bag. Anyway, over here, we've got a suitcase full of clothes we're not wearing, one of the Alexas, Christmas presents, lol. Um, that box empty. The cat climber is ready just to be dismantled probably and took out. Like we've took all their toys out. I need to go back there. I'm scared might be spiders. I need to do that now. It looks like really messy because we've just been yanking everything out. This is one of my Christmas presents from Harrison. I asked for it. So there we go. Some of the coats are gone but also it's absolutely freezing outside. You can literally see the white out the window. It's still a bit snowy. Um, dining room, all the cat stuff's gone. Obviously the fridge broke like a few days before we went to New York, so we had to go back to our old fridge, but it's okay. We move. These are all empty boxes which are ready to go. This is the cat, this is some plates and stuff. Boxes to fill. Hot tub drying before it goes into this box. Hot tub. Wash going on. These are just loads of carry bags, basically. This cupboard's got a couple things in, not a lot though. A plane, I don't know, well, it's just gonna have to be carried. We can't pack that. Towels because we've been putting them in between the plates. No curtains because we've tucked them down. Oil radiator in another box filled. Nothing really showy in the bathroom. It's all done. Um, one of the problem rooms, but this has been empty for absolutely ages. Again, story from the time. We're getting a van on Monday night for like these. This can probably be dismantled, but. Take them, I need to move this. Let's take this now. That dehumidifier. So we don't forget the pump. Oh, goodness gracious me, I'm out of breath. This is like, well, this is all like tarpies. These are all boxed up, girly things. Like, I don't want to like take them out of here just now because I'm going to shoot. All this can just come. I think that's actually let me rub in from holiday, lol. <laughs> this room, another problem room kind of, but again, this is empty, it's just got curtains and we need to hang up. Chair, well the outer layer's been washed but this is ready to go. Off the bathroom wall, Christmas paper. Some things which I've kept out just because I like the sticky note, I might need to use them. Um, yeah, this is currently Harrison's wardrobe. Part of the story for another day, I've said that like seven times but this is Harrison's wardrobe at the minute. Bedroom. This is pretty much the same because we obviously sleep in here every night. Hot wobbles because it's absolutely freezing. I don't know what Harrison's doing with this money, so I'm just going to leave that there for him to deal with. All of his dirty washing on the floor as well, I've just shown you all. That was Harrison. He did get... He was up at six today. This is obviously just going to come as it is. Some cute pics. This is all like toiletries, all like... It's always hard doing toiletries because like, you're still using them obviously. Wardrobes will have like, pretty much emptied out. This is like my... These are like hoodies, which again, I didn't want to lose because it's cold. I've just been packing stuff we definitely won't wear. Like these are like Harrison's work tops. And these are like me joggers I wear every day. Blah, blah, blah. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That'll go. This one's empty as well because this was Harrison's wardrobe. All these shelves. But yeah, basically purifier. So we need to bring these with us. But I don't know what's down there. Again, there might be spiders. So I might wait for Harrison to come and touch that lol. Some wellies could use with them. But yeah, there we have it. Obviously the cats aren't here. They have been, well, when once things start going pet with this house, they stayed at home for a little bit, um, just for safety reasons. So my mom, like, I mean, they love sitting with the grandmas. My mum's got seven cats at the minute, but you know, we love that. Um, and then they came here for a few nights and then we went to New York and then the boys have just stayed up there since. So like, I'm going up to see them all the time. But as soon as we're in the new house and the heating's on, they'll be moving in with us, definitely. Hopefully before Christmas they'll get a come stay, but if not, we'll just take it as it comes. But yeah, it's very quiet, it's very lonely without them. Oh, 
me causing issues. But yeah, all exciting. We didn't plan to move this close to Christmas. We weren't actually planning to move at all, but you know, everything happens for a reason and on to bigger and better things. Um, yeah, all positive. I can't lie, this hasn't come without its tears, this whole scenario. But you know, we're human, we're allowed to be upset, frustrated, angry, whatever you want to say. But yeah, I thought I'd bring you on the long on the journey. Can't guarantee how much I'll film because one, it's icy and cold and just it's, it's not great for moving. And two, it's when we get the van, we're doing all the big stuff, like it's fine now and we're like we're doing our normal lives around moving stuff, but I'll show you what I can and I'll definitely like once we get the new house I'll take the camera today and show you around. But anyway, that's the current state of the house. Hello everyone. So since that last clip you saw of me going around our like old house we'll call it, um, I haven't picked up the camera. Um I'd say things haven't been going as we'd hoped. Obviously we've we've still got no heat in the house where I am right now. We might be moving in like officially, officially today, sleeping at night, etc. Um so there's no heat, no hot water which isn't great when it's winter. Um, and I still don't know what's going on. Eon, I keep ringing them, they can't answer me questions. So I'm gonna have to ring them again at nine on the dot. Yesterday for the first phone call, I was on hold for like 50 minutes. And the time after, again, it was another 50 minutes. And the first phone call I was on, the worst connection ever, and I kept saying, I was like, he was like, I can hear you fine. I was like, yes, but your your voice keeps like crackling. I think he's like, Mike must've been like, I don't know, not working, but. Didn't understand a word you were saying because the connection was that bad. Um, so yeah, we got nowhere really yesterday with the heating situation on the Eon side of things. I don't know, the boiler has been, we've been told the boiler has been fixed, but we'll can't check because I don't, honestly, I don't even know. I don't know. It hasn't come without tears. I had a good cry last night, not going to lie. <laughs> so we love it. I'm all right this morning. I'm feeling more positive. Um, anyway, whilst I'm in the house by myself, because we've got Wi-Fi here and the meters are obviously here, I'm by myself. My mum and Peter are going to pack the van. Harrison's on his way here. He's just been in the parcel office to get a Christmas present of mine. I thought I'd give you a little tour of what's going on in the house right now, the new house. It's a mess because I started moving things last night and all this week, as you know. Um, but yeah, you're on my phone because I didn't bring the camera because I didn't even think about it, to be honest. But anyway, I'll turn the camera around and I'll show you around now. So I'll start with my favourite. The first thing I did was um, put the Christmas tree up. Cute little tree skirt. Um, I was gifted from Cherries and I'm absolutely buzzing with it. But anyway, tree she loves. We've got a little fireplace going on here. A couple of Christmas cards. Santa. Like I say, there's a cat litter tree. Don't even know what's in here. I think this is boots, which are still in a bag from New York. Scissors. Not a clue. Working Wi Fi, which we love. These are two dining room chairs, which we got new from. It's a place called Argos Stanley. It's like clearance center where you get all of Argos. Oh, gosh, and seems to be stuff like really reduced. Um, so we've got two dining room chairs because obviously ours had to go at the tip again. That's the story for another time. We've got our old footrest, our sofa from the flat. <laughs> this is the table which we also got from Argos Stanley. Look, I'll show you how much it was. Really... Here's a fan here because it's been freezing. We got it for £40, it was maybe 80 It's just like this. Nice white table. Um, big window there, not sure you because you know, we revealed the location of where I am safety things this is the cat's box so this is like the dining room area sorry that's the living room dining room area which we've now got a dining table this is just loads of idk to be honest stuff everywhere which needs to be organized but today's like building and moving the big stuff we'll do that so anyway you come out into the hall I'm not going to go in here because this is where the um meters are which are causing us a lot of stress and then we have the kitchen we got a fridge. There I am. Hi. Um, I need to give it a wash out, but I don't have any hot water, so she can't. Hot tub, which needs to go in the garage. The garage is like that wall through there. Some cupboards here. There's lots of counter space, which is really good. There's the sink. Cooker, washer, I'll go there. And you see lots of cupboard space, some grey tiles. And then the thing which sort of on the house was the porch at the back. So here's one porch. Great for our little kitty cats. And then we come out of the kitchen. Oh, hallway. So yeah, I don't know. This is a lot going on here. And then there's another porch behind here, but I can't open it because we've got stuff behind. So the porch at both sides, which is like ideal for us. Anyway, she's turned around. So it's like, this is what I mean. It's like, I really like the house. It's all we find when the heat and hot water works. I know it is, but 
that's why I'm more positive today. So that's obviously the downstairs hallway, and then we're gonna go up the stairs. Bathroom, we've got bath, shower, sink, catalytic tray, which has been used to drain this radiator about seven million times. But you know, who says litter trays don't come in handy? That's all I have to say. Some nice glittery curtains, which Mum and Peter got us for Christmas from Dalton Park. Next, their like home section was really good. Apparently, like the curtains and stuff were really reduced. So yeah, come on. I'm waiting for Harrison. Cloves, cute lampshade, Crocs. Yeah, cat's bed most important. So this is gonna be our room. So the TV is gonna go down here. Bed will go here. Side table, side table. Good morning, she's not trustworthy tracksuit. Everyone knows. So yeah, this is eventually gonna be spare room as well. So we're, me and Harrison are planning on, we want a bigger bed. because we've got a double at the minute. And with me and him and the two cats in, it's just not enough room. So eventually there'll be like a double bed here, our double bed, and then we'll get a new bed. But that's the future. But this is also gonna be like an office because Obviously I work from home a bit and Harrison also works from home a bit. So we do, it's good to have like a little office space. So I'm gonna put like the desk over here, which is coming from my old house anyway. Harrison's massage bed. Um, this is from the COVID test site. If you know, you know, we love it. I'm gonna call this like my dressing room. Um, would Harrison agree? I don't know, but I'll, I'll explain. So a cute lampshade, cute. So basically, my white wardrobe, which has been with me through Bedford and all the way here, is going to go along this wall here. I have a new dressing table, which is going to go here, because we've had, oh, again, sorry for the time, it's one of those ones. Dressing table there, then we've got a white, is it Calax? You know, the square unit? That's going to go there. Um, we've only got one chair for the desk on there, but that's uh, not an output, it'll be a different time. But obviously this has been a lot of storage room. But we do have like um, this good cupboard here. <laughs> Strong, or am I weak? So we can put stuff in there. But yeah, that's pretty much the house. So there you have it. We, this is our house currently, the state it's in. Um, it's absolutely freezing. Not gonna lie, my hands are like ice. I've got about seven pairs of socks on, stay warm. And yeah, so I'm just waiting for Harrison to get here then. Like I said, we're going to start shifting some stuff around into the right rooms so that when Mum and Peter get here, we can unload the van. And Peter, I don't know if he's going to build first or carry on moving. Like, I don't know what the POE is. But as long as we have room to do things elsewhere. This light, I need to work out. Yeah, that's quite good. Cute. She's just working on it. But yeah, I'll if I record anything else, I'll put it in the vlog. If not, who knows? And I'll see. It'll just be a clip of the house sooner. Soon, I guess. <laughs> right, see you soon. Hello, everyone. That was disgusting, Harrison Dowling. Um, we've just come to hand our keys over at our little house that we are leaving. It's a um, very bittersweet moment, I feel. It's been, it's quite sad, isn't it? We're talking about it Harrison is. is here. We've been saying how it's sad, like, we weren't planning on leaving, but unfortunately, like, we are, basically. Um, this condition state of the house is not the best and the overall service around it's been a bit hard hasn't it it's been hard from the day we got in the house but particularly the last month and a half it's got like it's just been not great but anyway i'll give you a little walk around tour of the empty house i guess say goodbye bye there'll be no more videos in here here we have had i was gonna say husband how are you <laughs> speak here we have harrison in the living room no comment <laughs> i'm not i'm not i'm going to disclose that information at some other point in my life um goodbye to the back garden tv it's massive without everything in here now we're upstairs this is one of the rooms basically random room I think they're here, but we don't know. Yeah, it's the estate agency. Oh, okay. Um, I've just seen themes and things. Here is the other bedroom. Everything back the way it was when we got here. How sad. Our bedroom. We're seeing like sad. 
all four of us would sleep in here every night. So big and empty. Very sad. In different circumstances. Probably wouldn't have moved out right now. Anyway, better go downstairs. Hello everyone. Um, this is like the end of the moving vlog. I'm gonna do a little house tour now. What is this bit of hair doing? I've just shoved my hair up. Cute, she's gonna rock with it. Um, yeah, we've just put the Christmas decorations down because it's the 2nd of January, 2023. Happy New Year. Mad, it's gonna be a great year, I can already feel it. But I'm gonna give you a quick tour around the house and then yeah, I'll get this edited, uploaded and you'll see my little moving vlog. So this is currently the third time I'm trying to film this little house tour. Um, my camera memory card's coming up saying memory card error, so I don't know, it's not recording. Um, I'm hoping I haven't lost any footage because I can't remember if I've got all my New York footage off it yet. I don't know, there's Ruby got the toilet as well. Nothing new here. So anyway, I'm recording on my phone because I just want to get this little video done and then I can edit it, upload it and it's Ruby's on the toilet talking. Hello. It's alright Ruby, I'm just recording. My and Harrison's room with our sunset glow coming through the window. This is our new king size bed which we are obsessed with. Um, it gives us loads of room because I sleep this side, Harrison sleeps that side and Ruby and Ricky sleep down the middle even during the day. The TV's this side boys' bed down there and then yeah this is our room we love it it's really cute like i'm really happy with our room it's very room vibes if you get me so i'm back onto the landing oh we'll come back to there ruby's on the loo <laughs> this is my office and um, we call it that basically because it's got all my stuff in and this is where i do my work got brand stuff there my cricket there books scrapbooks polaroid all that jazz you know you know my little desk space, we love it. My new 2023 diary, happy new year, whoop whoop, we love that. Um, There's me, you know, cute. We love, I, yeah, I love it, like, I can't complain, like, mint. Ooh, this is my wardrobe with more of my stuff on top. Like, this wardrobe has been with me for ages. My little plastic drawers, my sports wearing. Me and Harrison need to do this at some point, lol. And yeah, this is like, I love this room, like, I'm so happy with this room, it's... I'm very satisfied, let's say. Anyway, we come out of here. We've got a big cupboard in here. This is like toilet reuse, some loads of random stuff, as you can imagine. This next room is Harrison's office splash, splash slash spare room slash. You'll be able to hear the dehumidifiers, dehumidifiers on. There's me in the big mirrors. These came with the house, so Harrison's got loads of clothes in it, and then we've got like bed sheets and stuff. This is obviously our old bed, which is now a spare bed, which is perfect when we have people come and stay. This is Harrison's desk, which has currently got washing right next to it, but you know, like that's life. <laughs> we'll push it to the side in a minute. Um, yeah, this is from our old house. We managed to bring this with us, a chair from my home home. Yeah, basically Harrison's little desk. The clothes rail, which we had, if you knew, I don't know if you know. Our washing bag, love that. I hope the boys were up here because I'm gonna show it because the dehumidifier's on. Anyway, we'll pull that door up because otherwise it's not effective. Anyway, we come over here. This is the bathroom. My bath mat is really cute, but it's currently drying, so leave that for now. Human toilet, cat toilet together. We've got a sink. And this is our little bath. Slash shower. And look at that glow. We love it. Anyway, let's go down the stairs. Hello, Robin. As you can see, I'm going down the stairs. This is one porch. We've got two porches, which is why we like it, don't we, Ruby? Yeah! My camera's not working. I don't know what's going on in the memory card. Anyway, we're coming to the living room. Let's just quickly go and pause Kyle Palo because when are we not watching Kyle? Let's be real. There he is. Anyway, this is our fireplace with some cute flowers. I arranged these myself from Ikea's flowers. We'll be showing us around. He also went to the toilet. Then we're going over here. This is the cat area. The cat climber. The food, the fountain. The toilet, Ruby's little mat, which he, I don't know what he likes to do, he just likes to roll on it. This is our new dining table, because ours obviously had to go the journey. Um, Yeah, we got this, like, the table, how much was the table? Is that 30? I think it was 29.99, this one. We got it from Argos Stanley, which is like a clearance store for Argos. So the table's like 29.99, I'm pretty sure the chairs were like, were they 24.99? Yeah. We've got two chairs up. Dead sheep anyway. 
that's basically all I had to say. Um, then we've got our, is this a Calyx unit? I think, I can't remember. But I think that's what it is. You know, you know, these ones. Then we actually have our old sofa from the flat, which has been upstairs at our old house for ages, with one of our armchairs from the living room at the old house. Complicated, but anyway, the rug, the TV, all exciting things. Christmas chocolates, because who doesn't have millions of them at the minute? A really cute camp calendar of the boys, but it's Ricky's birthday month, so it's Ricky month. And then we have a Harry Potter cupboard, which Ruby really wants to go into, but he's not allowed. And finally, we're in the kitchen. There's Harrison in the reflection. Peace. Um, different fridge because this gap is a lot smaller than what we had, but that's all right. We're doing all right. Oh, lovely air fryer. Another porch. A sink. A washer. A Harrison. Um, yeah, it's going really well, actually. How are you finding the new house, Harrison? It's good. It's a lot more cosy, a lot more homely. A lot more homely, so, yeah. yeah. It's going well, but it that's about it for this video. Thanks for yeah. watching. I'm sure we'll see you all in the next one. <laughs>